What's going on guys? Today I'm going to show you two very quick ways that you can remove or block all in-app advertisements on your iOS device. So this works on your iPhone, iPad, iPod Touch, all of those devices, um, you can remove all of the ads. So I'll show you exactly what I'm talking about. So the Score app, for example, um, everyone uses this app, or a lot of people do. And at the very top, you have this advertisement video, which is very annoying. Um, also, if you go into many different games, um, this is just one that I downloaded a second ago. And uh, once you start it up and start playing, it'll have the banner at the bottom of the screen. Um, also, games will have the big pop-up ads that make you wait like 10 seconds in order to click the little X in the corner before you can keep playing. So this is going to remove all of these advertisements on your device and it is very easy to do. So the first way that you can block all of the ads on your iOS device, you may already know how to do this. Um, if you just turn off your data connection and your Wi-Fi connection and then reload the app. So make sure you go into your uh, recent apps and cancel out those two apps. Um, and once you boot them back up, if you're not connected to any internet, uh, there will be no ad. So as you can see, the ad that had this app had the ad on the bottom, the banner, that is now gone. Um, this isn't the ideal method because if you have an app that you need the internet for, like let's say for the Score app, if I go into the Score app, um, it won't even load up without internet. So the second way is going to allow you to remove these ads even with your internet connection turned on. So the second way that you can remove ads on your device is by installing a VPN or virtual private network. So head over to the App Store and search for an app called Luna, L-U-N-A, and hit search. And go ahead and download this app right here. Um, just download it like you normally do. And uh, once it is done, go ahead and open up the app. So once it's done downloading, go ahead and open it on up. And once it starts up, it'll see a little power button in the middle. By connecting the VPN, you agree to our terms and conditions. So I recommend reading those, but I'm just going to go ahead and turn this on. And you will have to click allow with this little pop up here. So hit allow. It's going to take you into the VPN page in your settings app of your phone. So just go ahead and enter your passcode to your device if you have one. Once you enter your passcode, the power button will turn green and will say you are now connected. So you can click through. There's a couple pop ups for the initial time that you turn it on that will kind of tell you a little bit about the app. But once you click through those and hit no thanks on push notifications, uh, you're now all up and running. It is connected and you can exit out of the app. So once you're connected, that's all you have to do. As you can see, I'm still connected to my Wi-Fi network. And if I go ahead and open this app up, and I start playing, there is absolutely no banner ads at the bottom, and also no big full screen pop-up ads will show up. And I am still connected to the internet. If we head over to the Score app and reload it, once again, that video ad at the very top is now gone. Um, you can go through and, and do everything that you'd normally do with these apps, uh, except you don't have these annoying ads blocking uh, some of the screen. So this will allow these apps to start up faster. It has less to load. Um, it'll also save you some data. If you're using your data connection, uh, it won't have to load these videos and these advertisements that these apps will create. So all in all, this is something that you should definitely do. and. Uh, if you learned something new in this video, be sure to hit the like below and hit subscribe. Peace.